Hello and welcome to the Fibonacci free video for Monday, June the 6th. This is David and here this evening I want to take another look at uh, Amazon here, which we looked at Friday night before it traded split adjusted. Of course, all of the, the uh, prices were divided by 20 today to reflect that 20 for one stock split. Um, and we talked about uh, how we would see the voodoo lines uh, move to accommodate that today, where uh, here on Friday, we were closing right at this second most important of the voodoo line levels, the most important being these fire lines like this one down here now at uh, 101.56, right? So that would have been um, just over 2000 in, um, uh, in, in pre-split numbers, but that represented uh, a multi-month low here in Amazon, actually multi-year low here in Amazon, um, from which this market is trying to recover. And, uh, and, and now holding on a pullback late last week, this 122.19 level, which is where our, um, our nearby tree line is going to be. So, uh, look, the way these voodoo lines work and these roadmaps we can construct with them, so long as this market does generally hold that 122.19 level, we can potentially look for uh, for additional upside here. Um, and, you know, if it was going to turn down, we'd not only poke below this level, but probably bounce into uh, resistance here as well. And then we'd want to watch these 114.31 uh, and 109.44 levels between where we are now and that 101.56 level to see if this looks like it's going to um, retest to see if that most important level can hold. And if we do go all the way back down, there's a decent chance that it won't hold. That, uh, that 122.19 level, however, that's the, the real level I want to watch. Now, we could certainly come in here and pop a, um, a fib retracement on the move up from a couple of weeks ago into, um, into today's high. And notice that um, that that level is, you know, if we pull back from here, roughly a 23.6% retrace, uh, on the smaller end of the retrace levels that, um, that I use, but notice that right now, at least this, um, 114.31, 109.44, they don't exactly line up with any of our retracements. Now we could, if we're even going to pull back and i'm not saying we are but if we're going to pull back we might go higher first and that would require us to um to recalculate the retrace levels but looking at where the 61.8 comes in now here at 111.85 you know, if we were to break that, there's a little room below it. Um, that comes in near this 109.44 voodoo, um, voodoo snow line area. Any pullbacks above here might still work their way back above this tree line. But as I said at the outset, holding immediately above the tree line, this 122.19 level, that keeps the short-term focus immediately up. So that's what I have uh, here for you this evening. Hope you found it useful and I will see you at the next update. Without simpler trading, I could not have financial independence. This is one of the best investments that I ever made in my life. It's helping me find consistency. It's one of the things that won me